exactly right. Right, ladies and gentlemen, um, and others, um, welcome to this evening's cabinet meeting. Uh, I think this is going to be re relatively brief. I hope so. Um, some little matters of housekeeping. First of all, the fire evacuation procedures. No fire alarms are scheduled. Therefore, if one sounds, evacuate immediately. Uh, the fire exits at the rear and side of this room. Go down the stairs and meet in War Memorial Park. Uh, the meeting is being webcast, it is on. Um, and finally, mobile phones, if you've brought them with you, could you please make sure that they are switched to silent so we don't get cha-cha-cha or whatever it is interfering with the, uh, the proceedings. Right, apologies for absence. We have one apology for absence from Councillor Hannah Golding, who is away on council business. Um, declarations of interest? Anybody? Nope. Uh, urgent matters. We have no urgent matters to deal with. Um, I don't think. Therefore, we go to the minutes of the meeting of the 6th of March, um, which I are going to be signed, I think, at the next meeting of the Cabinet, as I don't actually have copies of them at the moment to sign. So they'll be done dealt with on... Uh, the 8th of May. Therefore, the only substantive item this evening is the adoption of an implementation of the Community Infrastructure Levy, SIL, as it is colloquially known. Uh, may I ask the Cabinet Member for Planning and Infrastructure, Councillor Rafael, to introduce it, please. Thank you, Leader. The papers are set out at Agenda Item 13 of the full Council papers, if you have them with you. Uh, and uh, the... Uh, report in short recommends that we adopt the community infrastructure levy for the borough. Uh, this follows uh, the inspection that took place by the examiner earlier this year. The examiner has endorsed the approach taken by the borough and subject to a number of modifications rec uh, is happy for us to um, uh, adopt the SIL charging schedule. Uh, this is a major step forward and, and allows us to implement the levy and so that the monies received will be uh, put forward for the, to fund the infrastructure that is necessary for, following the growth of the borough and the new housing that will be uh, built in the borough to benefit uh, all residents, uh, employees and visitors to the borough. In particular, the recommendation is set out in the uh, 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 amended agenda to uh, the full council and the recommendations are that uh, we are recommending to full council to note the findings of the examiner and that's one of the appendices in respect to the community infrastructure levy that we recommend to full council that the following are adopted for implementation of the, com of the community infrastructure levy for planning applications determined from the 25th of june 2018 that's when it kicks in effectively uh, A, the community infrastructure levy charging schedule, incorporating the modifications required by the examiner. B, the regulation 123 list. C, the planning obligations for infrastructure supplementary planning document. D, the SIL installments policy. E, the discretionary affordable housing relief policy. F, the payment in kind policy. And G, the SIL enforcement policy. And thirdly, that we recommend to Council to delegate to the Head of Planning and Infrastructure in consultation with the portfolio holder authority to make minor or editorial <coughs> changes to the above documents prior to publication. Uh, and uh, as you will see with the appendices and obviously the work that went in to producing uh, the charging schedule and indeed the submissions uh, that went before the examiner, I have to thank the officer team uh, on your behalf and I shall thank them again, some of whom are behind me, for all their hard work in uh, bringing this uh, successful result and I look forward to it being implemented in due course. So I recommend it to Cabinet uh, for um, you to... Um thank you, Councillor Rafael. I think uh, since there will be plenty of opportunity to discuss this tonight, uh, if we wish to, this, unless anybody has any objections to the, the proposal that the... And this wonderful thing, the community infrastructure levy charging schedule, sounds like some electric device that you plug in somewhere, doesn't it? Um, that we... Uh, 
pass these recommendations, which will go to council this evening. At which point, uh, there being no other items on the agenda, this meeting is now terminated.